fight Rachel 1 and uh, I got quite a lot of questions uh, saying on bridging people get problems on bridging uh, bridging to a uh, wheel archer together etc so I want to make this tutorial dedicated to bridging so I just gonna create a little tube I don't know just something to something like that okay so let me just hit F4 uh, right click and double poly delete all the top bits okay delete half of it here so let's pretend this uh wheel arch just gonna pull that up to make it something like that yeah so we can actually rotate it this might be a little bit easier I just wish on my ang angle snapping so angle snapping is here by the way what it does is uh, lets you rotate every 15 degrees so it's very precise uh, let's make a let's as you can see I created this I'm still in editable poly mode I can actually just go to normal again and uh, I'm gonna grab this hold shift and uh, just drag that back something like this uh, number of copies one keep this as, uh, copy uh, what instance does basically let me show you instant is if I'm gonna go to edit as you can see if I move here it's gonna move the same thing so you don't wanna do that so let me just undo that like, let me make one more copy once again and this time save this as a copy and the reference is just a uh, basically it is what it says uh, now you can't really bridge them together now what you need to do is go to your modifier panel scroll down as you can see a touch box just hit that and uh, hit an object you wanna select together as you can see you wanna get this into one object now so if you go in a in a vertex mode as you can see vertex is on both of these uh, so after you've done that so what you wanna do is go to edge tool scroll down select one edge and the second edge and the uh, bridge as you can see and uh, you might want to select a few of them as you can see let me select all four and uh, if I hit this bridge uh, it still bridges together but if they are a little bit messed up if Vetsu doesn't add up or something like that it's one bridge nothing uh, let me show you an example what I mean uh, if I just gonna make a cut here what I did is I added one more extra line and I'm gonna select exactly as much so normally as four as you can see I'm gonna select oops doesn't let me there we go and uh, select four on this side one two three four and click bridge as you can see that you're gonna get it's gonna be a mess you really really don't wanna do that because uh, you're gonna mess your geometry up and uh, you can bridge specific edges so if I hit on bridge specific edge so pick edge one pick this one and uh, pick edge two say this one it's gonna bridge them together as well uh, what else let me just delete this quick not this one oops so just uh, delete vertices at the same time just hold control and click the backspace uh, what else as you bridge it uh, let me just select these two again as you can see uh, if you got your panel open it's gonna do that automatically reverse triangle I don't really know what it does uh, after that you can add some more segments as you can see uh, smoothing don't really need to do that at all uh, bridge adjustment, uh, you really only use that if you actually want to make it curved shape or whatever uh, you can add segments uh, yeah, uh, you want to make sure that these two are attached otherwise it will not gonna work because if I'm gonna detach this, let me just show you just gonna scroll down oops, wrong one scroll down, uh, detach and uh, let's detach whatever and uh, if I try to bridge now I, I believe that's what most of the people do as you can see uh, if I click bridge now and uh, just, you won't let me select this as you can see I just enable select it I can bridge two what not I don't know two of them as you can see I can bridge them but I can't really bridge these two so yeah this is my tutorial on uh, bridging and I uh, hope it helped I hope, to, I hope it's actually fixed your issues uh, it's actually very simple to do as long as you actually listen what people what tutorial says and uh, I believe I think I explained it quite clearly uh, you have to attach them so if you got one segment scroll down 
just if you're gonna be in vertex mode you might not be able to find this uh, just go just collapse this click on little plus sign click on editable poly the bow is gonna become yellow and uh, attach as you can see you can either click this box and just attach object one or you can click attach and just select your object and you wanna make sure that when you select these brackets are gonna be over both of the objects you can click, click J to switch between them I really switch them off because I really don't like that and uh, yeah so after that you just can do what, wh whatever you want basically you just as you can see apply default material and uh, yeah this is my tutorial on bridges so thanks for watching uh, hope that helped uh, see you in the next video